Hello YouTube, I'm Vince White. I'm an employment attorney on this channel. We answer publicly posted questions from YouTube users getting folks the answers they need from an employment attorney. We have a comment here posted by YouTube Rainer9627 who was posting on our video about why 63% of people who fire with the EOC get fired and probably get a bad result as well, which is of course a video criticizing the EOC for how they handle cases. And that video is, I think, probably our most popular video. It's had about 930,000 views in two years. And whenever we run ads, that's where we point the ads to. So, you know, that video has produced a lot for us. Now, Rainer, I think, has had a bit of a bad experience so far. Rainer says, good luck finding an attorney. I've called about 12. They're all too busy! Exclamation point. Or, this is going to take a lot of work and they don't have time. Lazy. Period. Okay. That's all fair. I mean, I'm not going to disagree with you on any of that. Uh, I'm going to say you're probably going about getting an attorney wrong, and that's why I made this video, because I want to link you to our video on how to like pitch your case to employment attorneys to make it more appealing, because you're right. We are lazy. We're a lazy bunch. We're a lazy, odd, narcissistic bunch, and sometimes you got to manage us. And part of managing us is helping us to understand when your case is worth money, right? Uh, a lot of attorneys don't want to listen properly, or they're just not rationally self-interested, so they don't they don't pick up on the value of a given case, um, and that's a huge problem. So I'm linking down below a playlist of videos on how to go about crafting your elevator pitch to better capture the attention of some wayward employment attorney. We're all so deeply flawed that you need to you need to kind of be on top of. Uh, the process of, of obtaining an employment attorney in a lot of ways. You got to really make the case appealing because let's face it, there is way more potential cases than our employment attorneys. Um, this, this country could use 5x more employment attorneys as far as I can tell, just in the wild, like going around working on cases um, than it currently has. So, you know, you have to be the squeaky wheel and the appealing wheel in order to get help. So, Rainer, I'm going to link that playlist below. Um, a couple of quick points in that playlist that you'll find if you don't want to go listen to that playlist. You need to know exactly what your claims are. Like, what is your big money claim? What's the valuable claim? What's the low risk claim? And the highest value, lowest risk claim is the one you lead with. That's the one you talk about. You might want to talk about other things. You might want to talk about how frustrated you are. Don't. Talk about the high value, low risk claim. Lead with that. You have time to get into other things later right? I'm not telling you to not have conversations with your potential attorney. I'm telling you to lead with the thing that they will value most, which in most situations is going to be the money, right? Uh, we get in this industry for about two reasons. Help people make money. It's cool because in the industry, we only make money if we help people. So it's a pretty good unity of interest as far as that's concerned. Mm, but let's be honest, you really got to make the money, right? Uh, and you got to make the attorney know they're going to make the money. So lead with that. And then hit them with the evidence. Here's how I know this claim is the high risk, or high value, low risk claim. Here's the evidence I have. You could really work with this. This is going to make this claim a lot lower risk to pursue, right? Uh, and that's, the, that's the, the simple outline of how to pitch a claim to an employment attorney. And then we just have like 30 videos that expound on that topic at more length. I hope they're helpful to you. If they're not, it's okay. Give me the thumbs down. I appreciate that. Like I, I, if I deserve the thumbs down, give me the thumbs down. I'm, I'm good with it. If, however, it was helpful, like, subscribe, comment down below. It'll help our channel to grow. Take care, Raider. Good luck.